So I've hiked, I've hiked this place probably five or six times and only found one elk shed and a couple deer sheds that I just really wanted to figure it out because it was close to home. And it's like we got our first one of the day. Last year's little raghorn. Sweet. Glass this up from forever away. I thought it was a deer shed and I decided to go after it. it wasn't worth it, but walking this super thick oak down, just getting scratched to death. And it's like I got a hard white six. Not a bad little bull. Sweet, I'll pick it up for you. <laughs> I've been hiking about an hour. I got my first little raghorn. Cute little guy. <laughs> He's cute, huh? <laughs> A little brownie, I think. Sweet. All right, guys. Just chug, chugging along up in this really steep stuff, and I think I got a set. I got this side. This little five. And then. See if it's a match up here. Get my backpack down by the side. Good start to the day. We got three elk sheds now. We'll run a deer shed. Three brown elk sheds too. We got set. No, we don't. Two singles. <laughs> well, looks like we got two more singles to match up right here. In this gnarly, nasty country. Sweet. Probably is though. Just a little raghorn, so I probably, probably definitely is. This is cool country though. Really cool country. If we're gonna find a few more. Oh, I'm getting stormed on. It's snowing up in this canyon. That looks like a couple year old shed. Sweet. All right, we got the first one. Bobo, look, bud. Buddy. Look what we got, dude. Goofy little sucker. That is cool. Look at him. That is a unique shed. Sweet, I'll pick it up for you. There's a little brownie of the day. He is cool. <laughs> what? Happened to his back end there, but young bull. Anyways, um, and I found those three sets off that same bull in the same day, and I'm up here looking for his browns. And I found one deer shed that day, and it was a stud three point. And I just matched it up. <laughs> Check him out, dude. He's cool. I'm pretty pumped that I matched him up. Pretty similar on this side and his other side. Just a big three point, but sweet, couple years old. Now, time to go find the big boy. Six by. Broken the sword off. It's a little guy. So I've ran into that one I'm looking for. I'm really, really hoping though. Really hoping. Couple year old six. Chalky, I guess. Dark, and I haven't found that big set yet. I have to give her a half a day tomorrow and see if I can turn him up. It's been fun, though. Getting dark really quick. Almost out, and ran into my second brown of the day. A little six point. Sweet. What's up guys, just out here taking dogs on a walk. And I just 
my knee is bugging me, so I'm just walking these flats, just walking really slow, and I got in a bunch of chips from Native Americans, and look at this thing. That's cool. Cool blade, cool color. But then I look down, what we got there? That's a cool point, too. Serrated. Pretty sweet. All right, buddy, what you got there? Come here. Yeah, the horsies are in the barn, huh? Should we show them what this buck we matched up? Look. All right, well, he wants to go see the horses, but I was just going to show you guys this buck that I matched up this weekend. I found this side in November of last year and then went back in there when it opened up, when Colorado opened up this year. And Match this little guy up. He's not little, he's big. He's one of my biggest deer sets I've ever found, actually. It's the only deer set, deer sheds that I've found in that spot with a bunch of elk. Um, didn't find the, the bull that I was looking for, but I found this kind of cool. Found quite a few sheds, and this pretty cool one's got a twisted back end, and it's actually a self stander, so. You do it right? Hmm. Yeah, pretty cool. <laughs> but, anyways, it was a fun trip. And maybe I'll get back in there and see if I can find that set from those, those th that bull that was um, in there last year and the two years previous. But I don't know if he's in there or not this year. It's kind of a different year with all the snow, so he might not be back there. But still would like to go back at least one more time and try to match him up. But um, anyways, thanks guys for following along. Like I, like I always say, I appreciate it. Got my little Lockie John over here. Huh? So he loves the big sheds, huh? Ooh, that's a big horn, dude. It's Isn't Mimi. it? Where's Mimi? Mimi over there. It's Mimi over there. Alright, guys. I'm gonna go play with my kid. <laughs>